first bareback horse and uh, the first rodeo I ever went to was one of John Ely's. It was on, out on Vantage and my dad told me about it and he took me to it. And I got on a big yellow horse and he bucked me off and I've been doing it ever since. And I'm 30, so 13 to 30, whatever that is. Like I started this year, I was gonna rodeo with some, some, some guys or whatever friends, and uh, they they don't ride as well as me, and it didn't take long for them to get hurt. I don't know. Every time it seems like I've gotten hurt, I've had an, there's a moment before that where you got this instinct and you think about that for too late, and it's too late. When you, when, if you just react, it seems to work out better. A couple years ago. I got smashed in the chute, and that just sucks. And that hurt for a while, and then, you know, I got bucked off, and I got stepped on, and broke my foot. Stuff happens. It happens real quick, too. I guess when I first get behind the chutes, I'm usually one of the first ones there, because I give myself a little more time than normal people. And I don't like being in a rush, I guess. And Think about rodeo, think about the ride. And then half an hour before I have to ride, I start putting my tape on. And uh, yeah, I try to be ready, because I don't like being rushed by no shoot boss. In the Columbia River circuit, it's one of the one of the hardest because you got you know uh, Bobby Moat and Stephen Peoples and Austin Fought. I mean, you got good cowboys that have been doing this a long time and are very aggressive and heck, they they're yeah they're good. They're going to the NFR. So I mean, there ain't nothing wrong with dreaming big. But it'd be pretty cool to take their money. They would take mine enough. You can draw a better horse, and uh, you can, if you perform, you do everything right, you've been practicing to do, you can still beat uh, whatever, a three-time world champion bareback rider, whatever he is. It's, it's rodeo, nothing's impossible. It's not, not gonna, nothing good comes easy either, I guess.
I came home with 300 bucks and no broken bones, that'd be good. Anything else would be better.